Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Leia. For those who are new here and for those who are always supporting my channel, I appreciate you so much. Thank you and welcome back. Today I'm in a very beautiful nature place. Um, it's so beautiful here, guys. And today I would like to talk about my passion about diving. So if you're coming here in the Philippines, um, one of the best thing that you should indulge or you should try is diving whether free diving or scuba diving you should try both the philippines is known for a lot of very amazing diving spots in negros oriental there's a lot of dive spots where there are lots of um, turtles even manta rays in apo island Malapascua, where the, you can see some reef sharks in Siquijor as well, barracudas, and in Bohol, where the sardines are. So if you're coming to the Philippines, please, you must try at least snorkeling. If you're not into diving, at least snorkel so you can see the underwater world. But if you can try to discover or if you can try to do some free diving or scuba diving i would really really encourage you to do so because it's a different world out there when you're doing this free diving or scuba diving these are two different disciplines and two different worlds okay you might say like ah it's just uh, the same it's diving no actually it's very very different from each other the free diving is more on um into more attuned into your own body because you have to hold your breath while in scuba diving you don't need to hold your breath but still you have to maintain your pattern of breathing otherwise if you're out of the pattern um you will float back up so it's really two different discipline and if you come here and would like to try both don't take the course yet okay so the free diving has a level one course and the scuba diving also has an open open water course so i would encourage you guys to at least try the introductory or the discovery course so for the scuba diving there is what we call this discover scuba where you will have the course for half a day to one day and you will learn the basic like how to have the tank and how to be comfortable with the regulator how to breathe in and out and how to float um, how to take out the water in the mast if ever the water comes inside the mast so all of this and you'll be able to try and feel if it's for you same with free diving the introductory course of free diving you will be taught how to hold your breath longer you'll be taught how to relax and how to use your fins and stuff like that i would like you to try to at least have the introductory course before you're going to take the level one course all right and there's a lot here in um different parts of the philippines me i tried both at first i tried scuba diving and i love it i really love it because i will be able to like go down as deep as 20 meters and enjoy a different kind of underwater beauty there and for a long time like 40 minutes to one hour i'll be there now the free diving i it's also different it's really different um, in a way that I can move freely without a tank and I can chase the turtles faster. If the, if the turtles are fast, I can, I can like also swim a little bit faster. Um, I cannot do that with the tank because with the scuba diving, because you have to maintain the, the pattern, you have to maintain, um, your breathing and also your speed underwater and the buoyancy. So, so it's really two different world so discover both try both and see which one you like better and if you want to do both why not both just like me when it comes to sardine sardine run i would i would uh, prefer free diving for that because i like to chase the the sardines oh i love it there are two spots in the visayas for that there's in moalboal and there is in bohol 
in Napaling Point in Bohol where there's a lot of sardines that you can chase and it's really really amazing experience how to be able like really eye to eye with some of the sardines and <laughs> swim and chase and try to catch them it's really beautiful beautiful experience while i think if you're gonna scuba dive it's totally different because you can just you know float maintain your buoyancy and just watch the beautiful sardines hi butterfly which is also another kind of perspective. So it really depends on what kind of water activity or what, what creature are you chasing in the water. So it depends on that, what, which, are, which is better, the free diving or the scuba diving. So for example, in um, Apo Island, there are three different dive spots there. And I would recommend scuba diving there because you can enjoy more the the corals and if you are into mock diving then um, scuba diving is something that is better when it comes to that because you can stay longer and you can see really the the minute stuff the really tiny tiny beautiful tiny creatures and you can appreciate them more when you're go going to do the scuba diving you can't do that much with the free diving because of the limited breath hold that you have to do so it really depends on your intention it really depends on your um, goal of the diving but either way both are so cool to do both are so nice to do so i'm looking forward to swim with the sharks in malapascua so that one needs to be at least a uh, level one in scuba diving open water course in scuba diving so you have to do the course for that otherwise they won't let you dive so i'm excited for that of course, I'm going to take you guys there. And um, what else I'm looking forward to? The whale sharks I already did in Oslo. Um, that time, I didn't even know how to dive yet. That time, I didn't know how to free dive yet. But then, yeah, I was able to swim with the whale sharks in Oslo. But I want to go back there and also in Bohol where I can like swim freely now and uh, free dive now with the whale sharks. I also would like to add up my recommendation for scuba diving and free diving academy. So for scuba diving, I was with Ladder 2 Diving Center. Here's the link above with my interview with Kami. She is my, she was my uh, scuba diving instructor. She's French, but she can speak English very well. And for the Free Diving Academy, I go to Blue Apnea Bohol Free Diving Club and also Sikihor Free Diving Club. So the link, I put the link below. These are my recommended diving centers for you to check out if you're going to, if you want to learn free diving and scuba diving here in the Philippines. So yeah, if you're coming in the Philippines and you're looking for diving as one of the activities that would be healthy for your mind healthy for your lifestyle i'd really recommend you to try both free diving and scuba diving if you can do both that's great and if you try to discover which one fits you better or if you just want to do snorkeling and swimming please do so at least snorkel because at least when you snorkel you can still see the beautiful corals the beautiful underwater world so yeah Thank you so much. I hope that you have clicked the bell button so you will get notified whenever I upload a new video. And I'll see you next time. Have a lovely day or night wherever you are in the planet. And of course, for those who are new, if you like my vibe, please do subscribe. Bye!